What's going on there, guys? We back with another one. And we got Steven Jackson talking about something real serious today, guys. Now, this is a classic case of child support being used in a way that is not only for the child, but for the parent of the child. And it looks like Steven Jackson had went to court and may have lost, you know, whatever, whatever was going on. He didn't disclose exactly what it was for, but... He did say that his child wanted a $27,000 car and he's like, man, I've been giving y'all millions of dollars over this time. Where's that money? But I'm going to let Steven Jackson tell y'all and I'm going to be back with my commentary. Check it out. Mesh to all the youngsters out there. Ain't nobody worth having a baby with right now. Don't do it. Check it out. So imagine your son say, dad, this is a car for $27,000 I want to buy. Right? After you done paid Millions in child support, your son is calling you for a car that mama ain't gonna buy, right? 27, oh, I ain't, I'll send you a dub on it. Where the child support money at? She got, she got to have seven. She got to have something, right? Bam, I've sent that, no problem. I call her, I, I got I to gotta work, you know, I, I got a lot of stuff going on, I make some nice money. So she got me in court for some bull It ain't even nothing. I tell her I can't go. She don't want to go either, so I tell her to cancel it. She can't cancel it. It's out of her hands. Bam. We get in court today. She not there. Her lawyer say my son is getting rushed to the hospital by his mama because he tore his shoulder. My son at school. He tore his groin three days ago. But don't worry. They let him get away with that shit. But this documentary going to hurt a lot of fish. I learned something today. I just learned something today. And I I, I just didn't want to say this, but I've been, I've been in court a lot since I've been making money over motherfuckers who can't get it on their own, so they want to take yours. It won't happen. But check it out. If you ever in court, this is for the men, because I see the women do it a lot. If you ever go into court for child support, I'm giving y'all some free game now. For all the youngsters out there, whoever done made a mistake and had a baby by old, weird-ass, dying inside, miserable chick, hire a lawyer that's unattractive. I'm just saying, you can be mad at me all you want, but hire a lawyer that's unattractive, because I think judges feel sorry for them, and I would too, after I saw the lawyer I saw today. I would want to represent people and ruin other people's life if I look like that too. Yeah, I said it. Look out here. Find your ugly lawyer. They win a lot. Also, to you young hoopers, wear short shorts that your tight showing and your balls down there hanging out. It's not going to make you nicer in who. Just letting you know that. You can make your shorts. Go out there with some tights on in. Don't even wear no shorts. But that ain't going to help your game, bro. Making your shorts short as hell where you can see your tights under. That's whack. I'm sorry. Y'all. I don't know who told y'all that shit fly. Rolling your shorts up and all that. That's whack. And it ain't helping your game. All right? So cut that shit out, man. Leave that shit to the girls. Let, let the girls have that. You know what I'm saying? Men want to see men want to see women with tight stuff on while they play. Nobody want to see y'all with that, bro. Come on, man. Y'all doing too much. Come on, man. Let 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 the women have something now. These motherfuckers taking everything from women as it is. Now the hoopers rolling their shorts up and come on, bro. Let it go, bro. It's not gonna help your game. Leave that to the women. That sounds like a very stressful situation Steven Jackson is going through. And if he's already given millions of dollars and your son's asking for a twenty-seven thousand dollar car. I kind of wonder what's being said about the money he sent in. If you're old enough to ask for a car, did he go through his mom? Did his mom say, "Go ask your daddy"? You know, did, was it that type of energy? Because that should have been set aside. He should be able to get a car of twenty that costs twenty-seven thousand dollars. That should be easily attainable if he sent millions of dollars. One thing, and I'm not putting this on this lady, but one thing guys don't like to see is them sending money, the the woman not having a job, you know, but she's buying things worth thousands of dollars, purses, clothes, uh, cars, all this stuff. I do you one better. Guys really don't like to see them sending money in. The new guy has on J's and stuff. He not working. He ain't doing nothing, but somehow magically he's wearing the best clothes and all of that but your child don't have the things they need that right there is something that'll drive someone insane you know you're 
supporting another adult for money that I'm sending. And, you know, the government, they, they creating this because they know that's going to drive somebody crazy. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So I think sometimes it needs to be used better. I want women you know, on the other side of it to come in the comments and just talk about why stuff like that happens. Why does it not seem like the kid is getting everything they need sometimes, especially, and I'm talking about someone that's paying like Steven Jackson is, you know, he has to pay. And now, I mean, don't they garnish it out your wages? If you work, they garnish everybody's child support straight out their wages. So you get it. The child doesn't see it. I, I've seen, Sometimes where fathers will pay money and the mother will go ask for more in court and it work against her because the child was all, I mean, the father was already paying more than they had to pay. So I've seen that work in their favor somewhat, but make sure those funds are being set up for the child. The, the father needs to be able to complain and get those things investigated. Once it's sent, it needs to, it needs to have a paper trail, too, I feel like. Those funds need to be very specific when you send them. And it shouldn't be to support someone else's lifestyle for 18 years. You know, I think that's pretty that's pretty pathetic. Now, um, guys that try not, you know, try not to pay or try to not work to not pay, that's, that's bad, too. But I just, man, I feel for Steven Jackson on this. You know, cause that, but, but at the same time, one thing I will have to say is a lot of people make it not cool to, to not be running around and having sex as a teenager and all that, but it really is. It keeps, if you're not doing that, then you don't have to worry about that. Once you lay down with someone, everything else that happens after that is a function of that. And some people going to be mad about it. Hey, I was guilty of doing that too myself at the time. Luckily, I only have kids with my wife and we together right now. So I don't know what any of this feels like. I only just heard it secondhand from some of my friends, you know, that they got that high school sweetheart pregnant or they got a, a lady from somewhere pregnant and, the relationship turns sour and they're here today where they're paying money and they don't, they don't know exactly what the money is being used for, but it certainly ain't on their kid. Uh, they're called when it's time to get something, but they've already sent so much money. It's like, what? Why do I need to get it? They got the money for that. I've been sending that. So I don't know, man. I want to know what you fathers think about this though in the comments. Like, is it, do do I have any fathers following this channel that goes through something like this? Um, mothers, I want to hear from y'all too. I want to hear both sides of it, man. I really do. Let me know what you think in the comments, though. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Until next time, peace.